my original WDT broke a while ago. So I took John Kim's file, printed off some, I guess they're calling them card, since they're like flat, like a card. And did that today on my printer, 3D printer. I can post a video on my YouTube channel of that. And you get um, acupuncture needles. These ones are all bent because when this one broke, it just kind of, I was using it. <laughs> and they just got bent, so I had to get some new needles for this one, but uh, this is put together like this, but this is the stand from the original. When the needles were in here, it used to sit, and there was a handle on here like that. So I thought, well, instead of doing the bowl of rice like I've seen other people doing, or on his videos, it shows it to put it together. This one actually stands a little tall, but it still stands, so I'll probably just use it like that and let it sit on there. And since they're both white, it kind of matches my setup. So that is the WDT by J. John Kim, J. Kim Makes. for sturdiness. Putting it together it was a little wobbly but once you get all the needles in there and the trick is getting them in especially that center one without bending it. That one was a little tricky because you're sliding these across it in that center before you put the ones on the edge. But once you get them through those little holes on each side they kind of firm it up so it's not real loose and um, you can hang on to it. He also showed maybe putting tape around it, but I don't mind the look. It kind of gives it a unique look without the tape. The tape kind of looked messy. <laughs> so that is that. I will give it a test out in the morning when I make my coffee and use it in the portafilter. filter not sure if they're too long. I don't know if people have cut them to make them shorter or not, but let's see if I can get my, I usually, um, yeah, it's a little tricky to make sure you get that center one right in the center of that, but it stands and doesn't fall over, or if you just want to leave it on your counter, it doesn't roll away really, but I'll just probably do that and leave it, uh, sit out next to my machine. Um, I was just curious. When I usually do my WDT. I put my, I forget what it's called. This is hard to do with one hand. <laughs> um, sorry guys. I'm going to set my phone down here. Let's see if I can do this here. to see how deep the needles were going to go in. So once this is on, let's see if we can do this here. I don't want to scratch anything, but yeah, I think it'll be a nice, nice fit. So that's kind of what that'll look like when you put the coffee in there. So I don't think I'll need to shorten it, but like I said, I'll test it out in the morning. So that is, was well, my project today. Plus I had my grandbaby here and my kids, so it was a little hectic, but we got it done. So that's, that's the tool. <laughs>